Hello everyone. As the title suggests, in this video you'll discover more about this small charming device coming from the Chinese company FNIRASI, labeled as the DSO TC33N1. You'll get answers to whether it can replace popular small DSO oscilloscopes, DDS signal generators, and various inexpensive electronic component testers. So, let's get right into it. The DSO TC3 comes in a sturdy, high-quality package. As I opted for a slightly upgraded version, I received the PP100 1X and 10X oscilloscope probe. Yes, you heard that right, I received the PP100 probe, which isn't typically included. Along with the probe, they provided a BNC to MCX adapter. Perhaps not as practical, the DSO TC3 has three MCX connectors. Additionally, there are component tester probes, three of them, which I highly appreciate because I usually make them myself due to their practicality during component testing. There are also crocodile clips with MCX connectors for the signal generator. For a slightly higher price of three US dollars, you get significantly richer equipment. One great aspect is that this device comes with a manual in three languages, one of which is English. The device is equipped with a built-in lithium rechargeable battery of 1500 milliamp hours, providing approximately six hours of uninterrupted device operation. It charges via a USB-C cable, and on the device itself, there's a small LED light indicating the charging status, red while charging, and green when fully charged. After turning on the device, the main menu appears on the screen. Using the navigation arrows, you can select which function you want to use. I initially tested the oscilloscope function, which worked flawlessly. I didn't encounter any issues with signal triggering or with displaying the signal's characteristics. I operated it with auto-triggering since I need to study the manual to understand how to adjust options like probe multiplication, horizontal time, and others. The menu on the device for the oscilloscope function isn't particularly intuitive, at least not to me. The component tester is capable of testing nearly all electronic components. I tested capacitance, which was quite accurate, the diode tester function, and finally, resistance, where I encountered an issue. It seems to make a significant error with resistors. For a resistor marked as 10.2 ohms, this tester indicates over 11 ohms, which, in my opinion, is an unacceptable margin of error. I attempted to calibrate the device, but unfortunately, there was no change in its accuracy. And finally, I must mention that the signal generator also works as advertised. Overall, the Fenersi DSO TC3 is a neat pocket-sized device. However, it has its downsides, inaccurate resistance measurements, and the difficulty of replacing the battery due to the device's construction. It gives me the impression that it's designed to be used while functional and discarded once it stops working. However, the main question remains. Can it replace all the other inexpensive devices I mentioned? Certainly it can and provides significantly more and better quality. As for whether it's worth the $50 price tag, personally, I could have managed without it given the devices I already possess. Yet this one will surely find its practical applications because of its compact and generally user-friendly design. On a scale of 1 to 10, I'd rate it an 8. So, if you've enjoyed the video and found the content useful, please hit the like button and perhaps consider subscribing. Until the next video, keep an eye on my interesting short uploads that I post daily.